Tonight, new information on a deadly fire in Jeanette. Flames ripped through a row house around this time yesterday, killing a woman. And tonight, there are questions about the safety of the building before the fire. Ross Gadotti joins us live with more on that. Ross. Yeah, major breaking details throughout today regarding whether or not anybody should have been allowed to live in this structure in the first place. What's left of these row houses on South 7th Street in Jeanette continues to smolder a massive blaze destroying the units and claiming the life of one of the residents, 87-year-old Shirley Kokurhans. Kokurhans' body found just a few feet from her front door. The focus now, try to figure out what caused the killer blaze. We're going to have to bring in some machinery to do some excavation to, to get access to parts of the building to complete the investigation. There were some surveillance cameras in the area. The detectives were checking in to see if they were working and if they were able to capture anything. Today, Jeanette officials cited the building's owner, Robert Struhala, for failing to file important paperwork regarding tenants and the building's safety. We did issue six citations to the property owner this morning for failure to comply with city ordinances as far as rental property inspection and permitting procedures and failure to provide permits for occupancy for these uh, six units. Struhala wasn't home when we stopped by his Greensburg residence to ask about the occupancy permits as well as smoke detectors in the units. The amount of fire and smoke that we had and several of my guys are coming right away and said we didn't hear any smoke alarms going off. The occupants told us that they were only alerted by people banging on the door. All right, new at 6 o'clock, you're going to get the latest on the young woman who jumped from that burning building yesterday, and you're going to hear from a woman who lived in one of those units when they caught fire yesterday, and you'll also have to hear, you'll hear what she has to say about this whole smoke detector situation. That's new at 6. Please join us then. Reporting live, Ross Gennady, KDK TV News.